Hello, so good news mga kababayan. So last March 8, 2022, China officially joined the Convention Abolishing the Legalization of Documents or Public Documents for Use, also known as the Hague um, Apostille Convention. So what does it mean? By joining the convention, it will simplify the authentication of public documents to be used in China. Meaning, for us Filipinos, which we are also part of, we don't have to do the traditional legalization process that we have to apply for a postile and then send it to Chinese embassy for authentication. So it will save us money and of, of course um, time because usually it will take roughly around three to four days I think to legalize our document. We only have to send it to DFA for it to be authenticated or to be postilled. Take note that um, a postilled convention will take into effect in China by November 7. However, please wait for the official announcement of Chinese Embassy in the Philippines uh, for the complete guidelines and details regarding this um, changes of process so not all types of documents are covered by apostille so the only documents that they can cover are the following which usually covered by most of the documents we need to submit but to, to our employer so number one like for example birth marriage and that certificate um, number two is the police and NBI clearance and then the last one Oh, sorry, not the last one. Uh, the third one can be like um, notary, public notary. Like for example, you need to notarize attestation for a signature. Then of course, you have your um, school, university, um, academic diplomas, and transcripts, uh, transcript of records. And then of course, the last one is your PRC license. So with this one, really good news for us because alam nyo naman na super mahal or expensive na legalization for documents. So with this one, at least three of this can be used already. So nakasave pa tayo ng mga four or five. So. And yep, yeah, I think that's it. So thank you very much. And yeah, I'll just finish this one and have a nice day. Bye-bye.